My hot take is that there is no such thing as a cloud. It is just someone else's computer that is storing or processing your stuff and you are paying for that privilege. If you are fed up with subscription services and you want a more environmentally friendly option that doesn't rely on data centers for your digital world, then you can flip that script. You can run a small server from home and host your own storage, media, and even AI models. You do not need to be overly technical or spend much money on being able to do this. An old laptop or computer will do. I rescued this Dell from an e-waste bin ages ago, cleaned it up, flashed Ubuntu server onto a USB stick for free, and then wiped the old Windows partition on this computer. There's loads of tutorials online about how to set up your server. It's about 20 command lines and it will take you less than an hour to be able to do. Initially, I was typing them out on my TV monitor until I set up a secure shell protocol, also known as an SSH, so it could be managed from other devices. I skipped installing a graphical interface on my server because I wanted to save resources, and also I kind of enjoy looking into the void that is the terminal. This first subscription I wanted to get rid of was Netflix, so I installed Plex onto my server, which is a free alternative, logged in locally, and then installed the Plex app on my TV. So any media that I have on the server could be played anywhere. On this video, you can see that I did use Plex initially, but I also swapped over to an open source alternative called Jellyfin pretty quickly, and it works in exactly the same way. Don't forget that you can use tools like DeepSeek or ChatGPT that can be really helpful for helping you to come up with some command lines if you're not sure of how to take the next step. This is just one simple way to escape endless subscriptions. If you want a step-by-step -step guide on how to be able to do this, write guide in the comments and I'll get one sent across to you.